All right, now we have another video. And this video is my taco holster setup. And if you saw my first video of my regular hybrid setup, you'll, you'll also notice that this is pieced together with scrap. And I probably have about less than $10 into this one. <laughs> so anyway, so just to show you what we have here is we have a scissors jack, just like the other one, and that scissor jack will, will move back and forth, obviously. And then on the, the little bit of a difference we have between the other one is we had this one right here is two pieces of foam. And what's going to happen is the scissors jack is going to push equally, so to speak, these two pieces of foam together. And, and the goal that we're trying to get at is we're trying to create one of these right here, a taco holster. And I found that this thing creates such a good, you know, it, it, it's got such good compression that it's almost too good. It, there's been times where I've molded guns and I couldn't even pull them out <laughs> of, the, of the holster. So, so again, um, really close to the same, same process. We, we take a uh, piece of, um, Kydex that were like, like I say, this is a silicone, but it's pretend it's the hot Kydex. We take that hot Kydex, we put it over the gun. Obviously, this isn't big enough. Then we push the gun down inside of the uh, bladder here. So what this bladder does is it actually puts pressure on the bottom side or the top side of the gun. I don't know if you've ever made taco holes, so you get a kind of a weird gap. If you don't have a two-section taco holster just want to make them like this so so along with this setup and then I take the uh, drill and actuate the holster or the gun <laughs> and once I get it in there I create a uh, a uh, force to smash that together the kydex now is as a taco it smashes together and you know after a certain amount of time you just Open it back up, pull it out, and you get one of these. So, so really, again, that's just a different concept. The, the, you, you, can, you can take this whole piece and you can lay it like this on its side, which would be almost equivalent to the other press that I made. And I've made pancake holsters where I've had a form here on the bottom and I've had a the press coming in from the top and made um I I might have an example here if I can slip away for a second. This here is an example of a pancake holster I made. If you look at it you can see the <laughs> it's very very good uh, definition on these things almost too good. So again uh that's my my taco setup, um, very simple, you know, uh, very simple concept. You just have to make sure that your supports where your, where your actual presses are coming against, you got to make sure that those are very uh, heavily supported or else you're going to bend. I already broke one of these pipes, so I double supported it, as you can see. Again, any other questions, just uh, give me a holler, instant message me. I'd be happy to help you out.